Good morning, brothers and sisters. I trust that you had a good rest and that you are looking forward to this new day and this new week. This is Patkos, week 10. This morning I want to speak to you about no fear. I'm taking this theme from the book of Psalm, chapter 23, verse 4. And I'm reading to you verse 4. Even though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil, for you are with me. Your rod and your staff, they comfort me. In the Middle East, a shepherd carried only two tools, a rod and a staff. The rod became an extension of the shepherd's right arm as he guarded his sheep. He would drive pieces of metal into the knob and he could use that rod as a club to kill bears and snakes and to drive off wolves. Whenever the sheep saw the rod in the shepherd's hand, they knew he was guarding them. The shepherd also had a staff bent on one end to form a hook. That hook would be just perfect for reaching around the chest of a lamb or around the neck of a larger sheep. The staff was used to guide the sheep as they walked along a dangerous path. The shepherd could gently press the staff to a, a sheep's side or he could reach out with a hook and pull him back into the fold. If a sheep slipped over a steep or stumbled into a rocky creek bed, the sheep could be lifted up and restored to the flock. The rod guarded the sheep. The, star, the staff guided them. One protected the sheep, the other directed the sheep. Nothing was more comforting to the sheep than the sight of the rod and the staff. The shepherd would make sure his sheep got safely through the valley and all the way to the top of the mountain. Fear, dear brothers and sisters, is universal. We all fear something. Perhaps it's loss, sickness, financial ruin, terrorism, or perhaps the most common fear of all, public speaking. Death is also a common fear and death is of course also universal one day we will pass from this earth we will go through the valley of the shadow of death and emerge on the mountain top that is heaven while we are assured of heaven we still shrink in fear at the idea of losing this earthly life it's ironic that we should fear death at all, knowing that in passing away from this life, we enter into the presence of our shepherd. Though we have experienced his goodness in this life, and though we have been kept safe by his rod and staff, we have yet to meet him face to face. Death, however, is the gateway into this ultimate experience of living in God's presence for eternity. It's, it's the one fear that we should most easily discard. If we can trust Him with our life, we can also trust Him with our death. Dear brothers and sisters, this morning, for this week, do not fear, do not worry, do not let your anxieties take control of your life. Know that the shepherd is carrying in his hand his staff and his rod. He will be guiding us and he will be protecting us for this day and for this week. Trust him always without fear. May we have a blessed day, a blessed week. Do not worry. Do not be anxious. Do not fear for the shepherd is guiding us and protecting us with his rod and his staff. This is Patkos. May the Lord bless you, 
Stay safe and be blessed. I thank you very, very much.